In Boston's South End neighborhood, more than 20 artists at SOA open their galleries to the public on the first Friday of every month. According to a SOA spokesperson, First Friday attendance has been low, and this December's First Friday was no exception. So there is absolutely no crowds. I feel kind of sad for the artists because there's so much to see and there's so much talent here, but all the rooms are empty. Suzanne Schultz represents emerging artists who rely on in-person visitors and passers-by to gain exposure and sell their artwork. In my experience, it's all about foot traffic. Because the galleries don't attract as many people as other venues, I decided to utilize alternative venues, as I call them, working strictly with the luxury market, um, retail stores, furniture stores, hotels, restaurants. Um, where I felt the foot traffic was more. And having a heavier foot traffic led to more sales, for sure. One of Suzanne's clients, artist Joel Van Patten, has changed how he markets himself using social media. Since March, he said he spends two to three hours a day on social media, more than four times longer than before the pandemic. I think that that's a big benefit right now, is, is being up there more, having more product, more engagement, spend more time to it. Mainly on uh, Instagram and Facebook, and that's honestly where I find the majority of my business is through those two channels. Even though this first Friday was part of SOA's Christmas event, the South End Holiday Stroll, the markets were still largely empty. Schultz said this will be her last time participating in First Friday, and she won't be renewing her gallery's lease at the end of December. She hopes that her vacancy will bring new life to SOA. For BUTV 10, I'm Daphne Mark.